Rita Tinina, KTN News. In a somber moment, the media fraternity and Kenyans alike are taking in the devastating news of the death of veteran journalist Rita Tinina. Rita's body was discovered in a house in Kilelesha on Sunday afternoon, but there was no immediate confirmation on the cause of her death. Her colleagues at NTV said she was scheduled to be on duty on Sunday, but failed to show up and she could not be reached on her phone. It is a new show that she's not at work and no one knows her whereabouts. That is what prompted the search that led to the discovery. One of our colleagues told the media, unfortunately later, she was found dead in her house. Police said her house girl got concerned when she failed to wake up at 10 a.m. and called some of her friends. It is, however, Rita's seven-year-old baby who notified the house girl that her mother was unresponsive, according to police. Her body was taken to Umash Funeral Home at 5 p.m. Her employer, the National Media Group, also confirmed her death in an official statement released a few minutes ago. Rita Tinina has been in the media for over two decades, starting from NTV before she moved to KTN. She made a comeback to NTV in October last year. She held a Bachelor of Arts in Mass Communication and Media Studies from the University of Nairobi. A notable work includes the coverage of then Deputy President William Ruto's trial at The Hague 10 years ago, the government scorecard, the truck explosion at the Karai area in Naivasha, and the conversation stories including holding an interview on saving elephants. She also brought to Kenyans the life and times of Mama Lucy Kibaki, a biography of former first lady. Rita Tinina was a mother of one. Checking to X, Kenyans mourned the passing of the veteran journalist, including Governor Gladys Wanga, women rep Esther Bozaris, Dennis Itumbi, fellow journalist Linda Ogutu, among others. Safiri Salama Rita Tinina, in journalism, you remain a great journalist. Despite representing major stations while I worked for smaller media houses, your humility stood out as we covered events together. I remember how you pushed me to apply for a role at the Voice of America, wrote Dennis Itumbi. I am who I am because I stood on her shoulders while at NTV. My T9. Go well, my darling. Rita Tinina. The hand that held mine and never let go. I am broken. Rest, mommy. Really sad news on Rita's Tinina's passing. Sudden to hear about the passing of Rita Tinina, whose voice resonated across Kenya. Her professionalism and dedication to journalism will be greatly missed. Sending my deepest condolences to her family, her friends, and the media fraternity. Wrote Jakabimba. Rita Tinina's death comes as a surprise few hours after the country was shocked by the passing of another popular TikToker known as Brian Chira. May Rita rest in peace. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so and turn on the post notification.